Please chant Om three times, please. Om. Om. So friends, <laughs> I hope you have been listening, thinking over it and enjoying it. Now, as we saw in the morning, we call somebody a teacher, a guru, upadeshta, counselor, instructor, from whomsoever we have learned something. Different types of gurus are there. With that word guru, as I told you, ultimately the guru is one who dispels the darkness of ignorance. But there are two types of ignorance. One is ignorance about the objective world. And they are ignorance of how many things? Sounds of million kinds, touches of million kinds, tastes of million kinds, smells of million kinds, sights of million kinds, they about your own body, other people's bodies, thoughts. Yeah, are you getting that point? A huge list. Somebody introduces us to music, somebody introduces us to dance, somebody introduces us to language, somebody to the food, somebody to drugs, somebody to so many. But each person, whoever introduces us to something, we call him Menevinsa Sikha. I learned from him. He only introduced me to that. So now, please, each one of us, very sweet, each one of us, sit down and make a list. From whom, what did I learn? Who has introduced me what? Make your list. And then find out, in that huge list, whatever they have introduced me to, From the childhood, you have been introduced to a name that is of which Namakaranam. <laughs> when the child is born, so many different types of 15, 16 uh, rituals are to be done. One is Namakaranam, that is naming a baby. Because no child is born branded or with a name. He has to be given a name. We ask, oh, you have such a sweet name. Who gave you that name? My mommy, my papa, or my grandfather, or my grandfather. Somebody gave you a name. He is also a guru. Who taught you to eat these things? My mommy. Who introduced you to chocolate or ice cream? My uncle. Somebody like that you are into. Listen carefully. So how many such introductions are there in your life? Make a list. And amongst all these who are in the list of introducing me to something or other, please, is there anybody who has introduced me to myself? Listen that simple statement. All of them have introduced me to something. If this much you understand, finish. <laughs> all of them, with all good intentions, they have introduced me to something. And I am expected to announce myself to the world through that something. What more you want? Huh? I think class is over. Go. <laughs> Are you getting that point? It is so fantastic. That is, I am telling this all Atma Gyan, self knowledge is amazing. It is absolutely easy, easy, easy. What is difficult? What you have got 
to protect is difficult and everything they have introduced to me i have to protect it you have to protect your name <laughs> protect the family honor you have to protect your knowledge that you have picked up you have to protect the inheritance that you inherited you have to protect what your job your relationship your love your affection everything you have to protect nobody has introduced me to myself and whoever has introduced me to myself i don't need to protect it that protects me <laughs> amazing eh? what else you want tell me how beautiful you don't have to blame anybody oh that fellow introduced me to money that fellow introduced me that i have shut up they thought that was good with good intention they have introduced you to all nonsense <laughs> and whatever they have introduced to i shall be in trouble you know that uh, what is his name bhartruvari who writes bhoge roga vayam somebody introduced me to enjoyment entertainment luxuries bhoge roga vayam more and more you indulge the more and more the chance of suffering also eat too many sweet diabetic too many fatty food other things oh obesity have got too much of money this and that a greed incurable greed arjane dukham rakshane dukham nashe dukham to earn his pain to protect his pain of course it goes also pain what is this nonsense they have introduced us to <laughs> and they introduce us to different types of knowledge ayyo the rumba difficult why competitive mode who knows more who knows less i'm the only one right others have copied me everybody is defending this oh every one of those introduction to whatever to are introduced to you have to be defensive about it your name you have to protect your family name you have to protect kule chuti bhayam if you are a good dynasty ancestry oh don't let that name be spoiled eh? <laughs> kule chuti bhayam rupe jaraya bhayam this rupa who has given to you the rupa rupa means the beauty handsomeness suppose you have you are young now who give it to you it comes with the body towards the shape and size of your shape and size the way you look that is not your contribution maintenance is your contribution but you have to maintain it if you don't maintain it the most handsomest will be the fattest you know fattest slob or thinnest uh, uh, skeleton both way you are stupid <laughs> you have to maintain it rupe jaraya bhayam if you are handsome or uh, i mean uh, beautiful afraid of old age slowly white oh yo yo little uh, what is that uh, wrinkles ka uy uy so immediately we put you under under the sea uh, cosmetic surgery millions of rupees and how many you know that brazilian model most beautiful died 27 year old why she had undergone that cosmetic surgery some 30 40 times one time it got bungled up that died just think friend just think how it is make a list please sit down how many gurus you have hundreds of gurus that boy what is his name datatraya no datatraya yes 24 gurus bhagavatam is there maybe you shall see tomorrow or sometime we shall see 24 gurus because from whom somebody you learn something he or she or that becomes a guru you learn tolerance from the mother earth mother earth is not a man or a woman we call it mother but earth has what it doesn't know anything but you learn tolerance from that why you dig it bury it you know landslide whatever happens you fight a war on it whatever you do mother earth is looking tolerance so she is also a guru akasha remains unaffected untouched by anything huge cyclone passes tornado passes storm passes freezing cold there is a snow storm akasha is same huge cloud passing akasha is same summer winter winter everything is same you learn 
So that is what you learn from him. So that is also a guru. Tolerance I can learn. Accommodation I can learn. But still I can be very accommodative and very ignorant of myself. And therefore my good quality becomes a pain of, source of pain and conflict for me. Even after I tolerated everybody, nobody likes me. Even after I accepted everybody, nobody likes me. You understand the point? Even after I shared my entire wealth, nobody said that I am a wonderful person. They said, oh, he has it, why should he not give it? Bus. If you don't give, of course you are a damned one. If you give, you are again damned because you are a black market, black marketeer with heavy cash with yourself. Nobody shall praise you. There is only one person in the universe who praises me is my guru. Who introduces me to a myself, a dimension which nobody can tarnish it. Nobody can touch it. Apichet sudura achara bhajate maam ananya bhag sadhureva samandabhya samyak vivasito ishaha kshipram bhavati dharmatma satsvat santi nigachati arjuna pratijanihi name bhakta pranashyati. That is the absolute wisdom. Even if the person seems to be in the eyes of the people, he seems to be very miserly or overtly generous. Both are sickness. Too much of fat is sickness, too much of thinness also is sickness. Too much of goodness, you shall be disappointed. Nobody shall bother you. You are a very bad man, but some people, they will be afraid, of, they will accept you. But that also is a rotten life. Putting on a dress, listen friends, very simple. If you, if you need to be protected, If you depend upon something for your happiness, if you depend upon something for your importance, you are not a very important person. Why? Because what you are dependent upon, when that is taken away, you are nobody. Why people desperately try to hold on to the positions? Why people try desperately to hold on to the wealth they have got? Why people desperately hold on to the relationship that they have? Because if the relationship breaks down, your life is empty. If the wealth is squandered, again your life is empty. If the position is taken away, you are just a nobody. Naturally, therefore, you have to hold on to it. For your protection, you have to hold on to it. How can you be protected by depending on something? Impossible. As a child, when you were, I remember the one story, and you must have heard it also in every vernacular language that type of story will be there for children's story. The princess, always taken away by the bad magician, right? And the prince goes in search of the princess. When the prince goes in search of princess, the jungle and the sheep princess is sitting alone. He said, ah, this Rakshas, how, how come you are here? You came away, no, I didn't come, that Rakshas, giant, the devil or whatever, the demon took me away here. And uh, I don't know how to do. And uh, don't take me now. If you want to, if you come near me, he will come. He will know. He will come. He will kill you. He said, how do you find out then how he can be killed? Why don't you find out? The prince advised the princess. He said, okay, I shall do that. So princess, that in the evening when the, uh, the demon returns, and he says, he, he, she asks, okay, what do you want? He said, you must marry me. He said, yes, I will marry you, but this is a lonely place. I am frightened. I am afraid. Anytime anybody can come and kill me and destroy me. Suppose you are there, okay, I am strong. Suppose you are gone. Lady, what are you talking? Nobody can teach me, touch me. I am invincible. <laughs> Nobody can kill me. He said, no, 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 don't tell me that. Every person dies. Suppose you are coming up and down, somebody kills you or a heart attack, something somewhere happens. What can I do? I am so insecure. I can't stay with you, I can't marry you. The fellow fell for the trap. He said, you don't know, nobody can kill me. It's because, story, huh? children's story, because my life is not in this body. They can't kill me. My life, I have kept it hidden. These are the children's story. Huh? I have kept it hidden. Where have you kept it hidden? You see that big lake there? Yes. Inside that lake, right underneath, there is a temple there. Small built-in temple. You have to go there. There is a Shivalinga there. 
you remove the shiva linga and you go walk 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 in that tunnel you shall go into the another chamber in that chamber there is a very big iron chest to open it very and it is guarded by the terrible snakes and then you open it inside that there is a pot under a pot under a story you know so pot and it's a pot and it's a pot and in the last pot there is a bumblebee that bumblebee if somebody can mm, kill it that one that day i shall die and nobody can reach there because this lake is full of crocodiles sharks anybody jumps into it he'll be the first breakfast lunch dinner depending on time in which he jumping so there is no question of anybody no question of doing that so then what happens okay 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 i will tell you tomorrow and when he has gone for the day's tour the prince comes back he tell us this is what it is very very difficult he say you don't worry i shall find the way story no so the prince takes one animal he kills one or two animals from the jungle makes meat and throws in the lake when all these uh, two crocodiles they are busy eating that he jumps into it and reaches the t- m- center of it see the temple goes inside removes it takes it tempts it bring you know goes inside 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 and then brings the bumblebee in his hand what will happen mm. <laughs> the moment it mm, crushes the bumblebee the demon comes like wow dead and you know friends how many bumblebees we have in our life money mm, dead husband mm, dead position mm, dead children something happen dead something happens to your business dead are you getting that point how many bumblebees you have protected <laughs> the teacher is one who doesn't give you one more bumblebee is not an identity giver is identity shaker <laughs> shakes you off the all identities have them all but that's not you you understand the point how fantastic who oh, i am going to study shastra that will be another bumblebee hmm? the studying shastra will be shastri informed person there is a difference between gyani and a shastri person who understands one word aham om and once you understand that one word this entire gamut of scriptures explode in your head like vishnu sahasranama there are thousand names lalita sahasranama shiva sahasranama there are thousand some names one name you understand all the names explode in your head all means same thing call it sat call it chit call it anand call it chit nitya sarvagata stanu hu achalo yam sanadana ipo me you can have thousand some names one you understand everything explodes even if you don't understand you say i know it why whatever i understood you want to give a name you can give any name you like and that is the truth finish such confidence gyana gyani wise man do you want to be shastri that will be shastra if you are there there if anybody you have got a particular stand point and you will be so frightened anybody challenges it you won't like it some practices what is religion most people are practices religious practices in our um, tradition we worship in the morning in another tra- tradition we worship in the evening another tradition we look at east is somewhere west another tradition he says you must lie down like this sit down like this talk like this dress like this what are you doing for you to be you what practices you need tell me friends for you to be you first you should be there to practice you should be there to repeat you should be there to chant and what is that you should chant repeat practice forget get rid of it or grab to be yourself because you are existing who is teaching you to whom are you teaching the person who is already existing child is already conscious but you completely neglect that uh, fundamental existence you give him uh, thoughts 
and that is more important for the child and not a he that way which is conscious of his thought this tradition must be perpetuated because it has been ignored because westernized influence the identities that you have things that you have is more important no other tradition renunciation is held as in that respect there the renunciation means what stop eating food control yourself you know starve yourself to death and these people say very renunciate here the renunciation meet na prajayana dhanena tyagena ik amrutatva manasu tyaga renunciation of what false identity tyaga do not identify with something which is not you whatever you pick up there if you give up your religion you are sacrilege committing sacrilege in hindu sanatana hind vedic tradition it is great because it tells you you are not any of this faith any of this belief any of these names that is why in a look at this para puja this morning i were Oh, this boy, our Vishwa chanted it very well. Sometimes you must do. I finished some twenty lectures on that also. Beautiful. How is he? First day introduce children when you are ch uh, children. You must do puja. You must do worship. Nothing wrong. Please, but they don't just give it to be condemned to it. Ultimately, they take it away. Akhande sachida anande nirvi kalpei ka roopini sthite adhitiya bhavesmin katham puja vidhiyati. You stand there, so Lord. How do I katham puja vidhyate? How do I worship you? Why akhande sachida anande? In one indivisible, all pervasive, sat existence, consciousness, all pervasive, absolute bliss. Nirbikal pei ka roopini in which there is no bikalpa, no modification of any kind. Aditya bhave sthite smin, which is shining, existing, one without a second. There is no second thing. पूजा कथम भी दिए थे हाउ डू आई डू द पूजा दट इनकेपेसिटी टू डू द पूजा इज द हाइएस्ट पूजा हाउ डू आई वर शीप ओ लॉर्ड पूर्णश्य आवाहन कुत्र विच दैट इज ऑल परवेशिव हाउ डू आई इन वोक इज ऑलरेडी देयर सर्वाधार से आसनम दैट विच इज ऑल परवेशिव शाल आई हैव टू प्रोवाइड एन आसन आवाहनम आसनम स्वच्छस्य पाद्यम अर्घ्यम च द वन इज एब्सोल्युटली प्योर पाद्यम वाश इज फिट वर इज द फुट निष्कलम अद्वितीय पाद्यम अर्घ्यम शुद्ध से आचमनम कुतः एंड देन आई हैव टू प्यूरिफाई माय सेल्फ शुद्ध प्योर शुद्ध शुद्ध मीन्स वेदर इज नथिंग अदर देन इट अन अडल्टरेटेड नथिंग कैन गेट मिक्सड अप विथ इट प्योर 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 हाउ डू आई प्यूरिफाई माय सेल्फ And then I have to give him bath. Nirmala shi kuta snanam. Nirmala, who is full of, totally, absolutely free from every type of impurities, time, space, objectivity, everything is a impurity. Time edges you, impurity. Space limits you, impurity. Any identity is an impurity. Why? Because it limits you. Understand that, friends. Nirmala shi kuta snanam. How do I give a bath to that? And then I have to give him a cloth also, vastram, vishodarasya cha, one who has the whole universe, gross, subtle, causal, tripuri, the entire universe as his body. How do I find its end to provide in the cloth? How do you dress somebody, sir? To dress somebody, you must find both the ends. Find the end of the God, the existence. वस्त्र विश्वदरश्य निर्विशेष का भूषा कोलंकार निराकृत है निर्विशेष दर इज नथिंग कल ए बॉडी दिस एंड दैट व्हाट भूषा व्हाट टाइप ऑफ ड्रेस आई प्रोवाइड टू हिम कोलंकार निराकृत है व्हेन देर इज नो फॉर्म हाउ कैन ए गिवन लाइक दैट इज गोज ऑन हाउ मच इफ आई कैन दैट वन अदर थिंग अंडरस्टैंड अमेजिंग दैट विच इंट्रोड्यूस यू टू दैट सो दैट लाइक What is this fellow? Bro, for me to be introduced to the earth, I, you can't introduce me to the earth. So you create a globe. When I see it in my head, 
both the globe as well as the body get lost in the earth, the planet. Sitting down in front of God. Shiva, Hari, Rama, Krishna, any statue. In our tradition, it is not that if you by chance don't worship the God, you will get angry, your tradition will get angry. No. You start with a faith, you start with a belief, but don't end with a faith or a belief. You end up with a wisdom absolute. Shivaya Namaha, Namas Shivaya, Shivoham Shivoham. Everybody. There is no question of any discrimination there. Friend understands. So when you are starting with this type of differences, it's a sort of limp for limited time, for some time. But not to be condemned into that. Grow beyond, grow out of it. So when you thus, please, see yourself. Ask yourself, all that I have introduced to, they have become my bumblebees, in which my prana is dependent. Somebody disrespects your God, you shoot them down, like terrorist. Somebody disrespects your tradition, what are you doing? Trying to be protected by something which is unprotected? You hold on to practice, hold on to information, hold on to book. That is why the Guru introduces me to something which does not, by itself, which doesn't need any protection. My self being consciousness, it doesn't need any protection at all. That is a happy. Then, Enjoy all unprotected things. <laughs> the clothes that cover me are fragile. The roles that I take up are fragile. The roles will come to an end. I am eternal, absolute. How sweet. So all the people are given different roles and then the comparative roles and you say, he is a guru, he is a greater guru, he has given me more than that. Yes, that comparison will be there. He put me into college, you know, or else what would have happened to me? He gave me a job, or else what is the idea of education? Somebody gave me money, what is the idea of having a job and educated everything but no money? But my grandfather gave me a huge inheritance of five billion dollars. Oh boy! How long can you hold it? When the time snatches, when the soft footstep of the death reaches your ear. You feel the decadence. Any moment the breath will become air. When you are breathing, the air is you are breathing. Breath, prana. When the breath becomes air, you are finished. Who will protect? That is why Shankara is so sweet. This Shankaracharya, you know, I tell you, this boy is amazing, 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 amazing. To, it's better to tell his incarnation of Shiva, or else will be not even a human being. Donkeys, not even donkeys, worms. Just to give ourselves some semblance of respect, better to say he is Shiva incarnate. Because if you tell him he is a human being, then what are we? Huh? What are we? Just stupid. Mood, you know. Bhaja Govindam, Bhaja Govindam, Govindam, Bhaja Muramati. So when you say Bhaja Govindam, Bhaja Govindam, say that there are secret words. Govindam, Bhaja say, so you must worship only Govinda, only Krishna, and nobody else, only Krishna, 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 Rama is useless, Hari is useless, Shiva is useless. That is all a disastrous meaning. So he introduced him to Puja. Bhaja, Sikh, what? Govindam. What is Govindam? That which is Govi, he sabdai, he vandetai, the Govinda. That which is revealed by the words, revealed, somebody introduces you to yourself. Listen carefully. You can be introduced to yourself because you are already there. 
only one word tattva masid you are already there i don't give you new identity you are already there like you are standing here in ashram and looking for the ashram what shall you do run around dig a hole jump no not none of these things will give you the knowledge of ashram you will be still jumping there but still not knowing about it since you are standing already there gyanam that's that is somebody say hey what are you doing you are already here you are standing there should he say you are already here or say or he shall say i will give it to you if you close your eyes for 10 minutes now don't put me into nonsense are i am standing here tell me i am here say exactly same way understand words reveal the truth you being who you are tat tum asi you are that one who gives you that word reveals he doesn't put 100 conditions first don't do this first eat this don't eat this don't you married you are finished you will never know the truth huh really ladies of course shall never study vedas who said the yagi mal ke married boys or what two girls right gargi maitri and if women cannot study what is your chandogya upanishad what is what is your upanishad tripura rahasya who is the guru mother these are the type of fanciful ideas you're losing yourself in that for you to be you what practice you should have because you are there you are introduced to so many practices that is so many religions in the world sad part friends is you miss the one and lose yourself in the infinite hundred million things you know in our school i remember now it was really funny bille school no <laughs> one day there are uh, is a village school goats you know in the village are there they will go to school because there is no gate and no guard and all that nonsense nobody is there so there are uh, our boys these hostel fellows were you know only in uh, the small little type of town you can have this type of game because city bred children don't play with animals they play with tit 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 hands fingers you know nowadays you know that they don't know how to play with a butterfly they will not know how to play with a dragon fly they will not play, know how to play with a bumblebee they will not know how to play with a small baby snake they will not know how to play with a centipede because oh yeah, mummy is frightened baby is also much more frightened you know that is the thing that animals far away far away very disease 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 right but village they are your playmates you have to live with them sleep with them everything they are okay right think so these three there were um, they left it some goat in the school campus there is a five ten rooms and there be there you know and then what happens they marked them two wrote it down that two three four and left them next morning when prince everybody comes there is all over these goat droppings all over you know goats if you leave them one night they will be wonderful job they will do so many droppings so everybody is joking then the teacher says oh oh goats are there said so they catch one fellow two another fellow four another fellow three what is the number 1 the whole school is searching for the number 1 <laughs> these fellows deliberately had named 2 3 4 one they left <laughs> so intelligent people what will they do four goats are there so what is one number 1 they searching 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 never got school holiday What is the number one? Do tomorrow again they will come and do it. We all are that number one. Elusive number one. 
Adraman Marsi is a Binaika Sankhya and an evil, okay? Please start counting. Will you say three, seven, nine, fifteen, hundred, fifteen hundred thousand million? Right? Nonsense. Start with one. One, two, three, four. Because there is no other number. One is one. Two is one plus one. Three is one plus one plus one. Four is one plus one plus one plus one. Number one. No other number exists. Take away the number one, no other number can be there. And who is the number one in this universe? You. Whatever introduced, you are introduced to, whatever you are introduced to is number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, millions. Get lost in the games. <laughs> Looking for the one. The teacher is one who introduces me to number one. Me. Because it's I who is taking these roles. Roles were not there. I was there. Is it understandable or uh, mystery? <laughs> Are you getting that? First you. But you are lost in the roles. Why? Everybody is lost. I see my mother lost, my father lost, my brother lost, my society lost, my politicians lost, religious people. Everybody is lost. Science, history, chemistry, mathematics, every... What is friends? Like in COVID times, the masks are meeting. The person is completely tortured inside. Doesn't know anything about himself. Five-star hotels you go. Who are meeting? All star hotels you go, who is meeting? Even brothers and brothers don't meet, millionaires meet, poor brother, rich brother. Religious people are meeting, what are they meeting? Different types of dress, different types of you know, appearances, sort of uh, um, uniforms, different types of greetings, different types of chantings, different types of everything. With lost in this type of unnecessary differences, which can be literally forgettable differences, you are holding on to find the oneness. Holding on to differences, you can find oneness. Yes, you can find. When somebody introduces you to yourself, to whom all these identities are given. Like that celebrated story of Mula. The Mula was, you know, Mula was a fellow, a very poor man who suddenly became rich. He was going every other day, he will go to the neighboring town. So the policeman suddenly discovered how come he is becoming little better and better. New clothes are coming in, where from he is getting the money. So he must be smuggling something. So what he was telling? He was telling, you will go with his donkey and come back. And you know, it takes one. So they look over the donkey. What is the thing? They, they look at the only sand. And there on, inside the sand there is nothing. They let the fellow go. They go and come, go and come like that, but the mullah is becoming richer and richer and richer. Years passed, the immigration officer could not catch him. Now the immigration officer is retired. Same village fellow. Then he said, hey, now I am not the officer. Between the two of us, on or over a chai pe charcha, with one little, <laughs> on the, with the, while we are taking tea, please tell me the secret. What was that you are smuggling? I saw you, I searched your packet, I searched everything, nothing there, the donkey nonsense you are carrying, this, uh, what is that, wood or the sand or all this nonsense. What was that you are telling? Now I am not the officer, I am not catch you, you are my uncle, I am your nephew, so no problem. He said, I was uh, smuggling donkeys. <laughs> you will never, you will never, you will search for something which is on the donkey, that donkey is to be smuggled, you don't have an idea. Are you getting that point, please? You are searching everything that is on you, in you, above you, below you, but not you. Suppose the Guru goes and adding to something which is another upadhi, from today onwards you are this religious fellow, from today onwards you never say good morning, you shall say om om, hari om, or put two fingers up, or some nonsense. And from today you shall not eat this, you shall not eat that. From today you should take this mala and do only like this. And do not look at the east and west and something, look up or down. Something, something funny. 
Because you must be special, no? Why are you so allergic to being one with everything? Why am I so enamored by the idea of being better than everybody? Why? Why? Understand, friends, space is, there is no space comparison. American space is better than Indian space. There is no space pollution, atmosphere pollution. There is no immortality problem. Mortality is the problem. Immortality is same for all of us. Timeless, spaceless. Available at all times, all places, in all conditions. So what is this something? Can somebody give you? So make the list. How many gurus do you have? So many benefactors. Mommy, Papa, friends, people. So nice. Have respect for all. But respectfully challenge. Who is, respect, who is introducing me to what? Please, friends. All that they have given for a change, just for a moment, just for fun. All that whoever has given, whatever they have given from your childhood until now, mentally, please give it back to them. Just for a moment. Mentally. Mentally you have accepted it. It's a mental introduction. From today onwards, your wife, what happens to that girl or the boy, my husband? Mind. There is a thought. Until now, somebody's husband, somebody's even marriage, divorce, marry again and again, somebody's wife was there also, or, or somebody's husband. Jokes apart, friends. Listen carefully. It's an idea created. From today onwards, you are the husband, you are the wife. From today onwards, you are the friend. Taking an oath in the name of a country, taking an oath in the, for the position of a gov, you know, president or governor or minister or anywhere, when you're taking an oath, what it means? A thought is created in your head. From today onwards, you are like this. No personal thing should interfere. That's the thought is given to you. And that the important post you have been given. How many years? Four years. President, change. Coup. Kicked out in one day. Anyway, whatever they have given and which is remained in your head as your thought, can you please? Yet patitam tad guru vedidam As you do in the classroom Whatever the teacher gives Give it back to him and then go Like that in life Whatever has been given to us For a second sit down In one moment you can give up everything to everybody Or sit down for some time Name given up Position given up. Relationship, I'm a child, father, mother, husband, wife, given up. All relative identities, listen friends, relative identities. What is relative identities? Relative identity means in relation to something, I am this. In relation to riches, rich, relative identity. In relation to poverty, poor, relative identity. In relation to the body, boy or a girl. In relation to the condition of the body, young or old. Mahadeva. In relation to your degree, you are an art graduate, science graduate, postgraduate, undergraduate. In relation to the job, employed, unemployed. CEO or just a God, Darwan, God. In relation to what, sir? Belief. I am a believer of this or a believer of that. In relation to that, your faith, belief, on that. You call yours in relation to your country, citizen of this country or that country. Every one of these, what you are holding out as the important role, or very unimportant role, which makes you feel cringe inside you. I'm such a small man, I have no money. Throw it out. It was all given to you. To give it to you, friends, first you must be there as you are. Roles were given. Why are you 
embracing, holding on to, sticking to it, grabbing it, possessing it, intolerant of losing it. The body was given without your permission. Did somebody ask you? I'm going to give you a body. Willing? No. Boy or girl? Transgender? The body was given to us. You find yours at the body. It was given to us without our permission. It shall be taken away without your permission. Whoever, whatever thing they have given, mentally I give it to them. Mommy, thank you. Name is yours. Abba, thank you for the inheritance. Teachers, all types of teachers, thank you for the music, dance, PhD, physics, history, chemistry, mathematics. The boys who gave me bad habit, drinking, drugs, this nonsense, that is also give it to them. Nobody is born drunk, nobody is born addict, give it to them. The person who introduced me to a job, give it to them. Whatever they introduce to you, to a sound, touch, taste, smell, sight, everybody is a teacher, give it to them. What is left out? You alone are left out. And that something is true for all of us. Guru. I receive, these are relative identities. Why? In relation to my name, I was this name. In relation to my money, I was rich. In relation to my um, education, I have got a degree holder. In relation to my job, I am working. In relation to my, what? Positions, you have got a title. In relation to different conditions of the body or something. In relation, young or old, diseased or healthy, in relation to your thoughts of many kinds. You are sitting down inside your head. How many thoughts are coming? Mother's thought, you are a child. Somebody cheated you, Ooh. somebody gave you something nice, you liked it, chochu eat. Somebody gives you, you know, we say, you should never remember monkey when you are meditating. Tortured for life. You should never have a thought when you are meditating. Tortured for life. You must have only this thought to be liberated, tortured for life. You accept that thought, every other thought will come. For you to be you, what shall be given to you, friends? When all people, call them gurus of different kinds, give you something to give you an identity or hold on, the Brahma Vidya Guru takes away Takes away everything, doesn't touch it, doesn't dismiss anything, just take away that sense of I. Then name your body Ram, not you. That is why you don't like the name Ram, you made it Ramanathan. Anything that you can change is not you. You are changeless. Ajo nitya sasudayam purana. Ajaha, unborn, nitya, eternal, sasuda, ever existing, purana, purayavanava, even ancient time is fresh, sanatana, nitya, sarvagata, stanu, achaloyam, sanatana. Only you, only me. Between the Guru Sitya. No. What Bhagavan says? Hey Arjuna, Natvevaham jatunasam natvam neme janadipaha nachaivana bhavishyamaha sarve vayamatah param There was never a time when Arjuna when I was not. I am not or I shall not be. Oh, you are God. You can say that you are, you are, you shall be heard about me. Natvam. Never it shall happen when you are not, you are not, you shall not be. 
oh, between God and Krishna and friend Arjuna, the conspiracy, they will be there together. What about the image Anadipa, even all the kings? Anything in this universe, there is never a time they were, they were not. They are not, or they shall not be. Was, is, shall be. Relative identities were not, will not be. So even while existing, it doesn't exist. Relative identity, because things are dropping, so relative identity continuously change. And Mandukya Surti will tell tremendous. Adabante Chayan Nasti Vartamane Pitatatha. One, one line, friends. It can be the graffiti in the United Nations, around the world, every country, everywhere. Ado yat nasti, ante yat nasti, bartamane pi tattatha. That which was not before, will not be afterwards, even while existing, it doesn't exist. In the mystery, pot. Take an example. Clay was there. Listen, the pot was not there. The clay was there. The pot was not in the clay. The possibility was there. Listen, the pot appearance. Clay was there. We even when seeing the pot, clay is there. When the pot is broken, clay is there. Clay was, clay is, clay will be. But this form, Nama Rupa, this Rupa, was not. Will not be. Therefore, even while existing, it is as well not. Because when it is existing, in and through, only clay, clay, clay. The role that was not, the role that will not be, even while existing, it is not. Why? Fading away. As you are sitting down, your role is being consumed. As you are sitting down, the role of youth, passing, passing, passing. You are sitting down here now. Maybe your friend is meeting with an accident at this moment somewhere. Your friendship role, that you are a friend, is being consumed, finished already. You don't know. When you go back, you see the WhatsApp, you see the message, died in a car crash. Oh, yo! Ah. It was not. It will not be. For some time it is there. The gurus, millions of gurus, different types of gurus whom we respect and all that, fine sir. They introduce us to these fragile roles. Helping you to delude yourself that this shall be all everlasting. The guru, Brahmavidya guru, introduce you to yourself which was, which will be and now as it is, it has not changed absolutely. Knowing which? Yad gyantvana aparam ginyam. Knowing which there is nothing more to be known. Yad labdhvana aparam labham. By gaining which there is nothing further to be gained. Yad krutvana aparam krutyam. Aparam krutyam. By doing which nothing else to be done. Krutya krutya krutyoham. I have done all that is to be done. After infinity what? Wisdom. Even a king shall die for it. An emperor shall die for it. That is why in our tradition, the sadhus, the wise people were Maharaj. Why not a Maharaj, Piri Maharaj? The, the address is tree number 22. But the king comes and falls at his feet. Why? Because of this. This wisdom. Oh, that Durvasa fellow is angry, I will not. For every Durvasa, there is a Vashishta. For every Janaka and Rama, there is a Hiranyakashipu and Hiranyakya. So just looking at one, don't say everything is rotten. No. Inside you, there are thousands of roles. Every role is not exemplary. Please, get out of that idea. Our husband finds it very difficult. What is, I mean, mother's uh, name, you've seen Lalita Ambika, what do you say? Dhyatra, Dhyana, Dhyana, Dhyatra, Dheya, Rupa, 
धर्मा धर्म विवर्जिता धर्म अधर्म विवर्जिता ध्यान धेतृ ध्येय रूपा ही इज शी इज मेडिटेशन ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ मेडिटेशन मेडिटेट ऑल द थ्री वन एंड द सेम हु यू आर लिशन केयर बोली इन योर मेडिटेशन यू आर हु यू आर इफ यू फोकस ऑन समथिंग दैट यू हैव एजिटेशन why full of agitation because you focus on things that you have he told me like this he did that to me he took it away he gave it ah uh, if you focus on things that you have you are inviting agitation for rest of your life it will not last forever that is why no practices shall ever last when person is very old वट दिशाबाशी से नम उक्तिम विधेमा ओलोड एट दिस स्टेज ऑफ माय लाइफ व्हेन द लेग्स कैन नॉट वॉक टू द टेंपल हैंड्स कैन बी लिफ्टेड फॉर द नमस्कार माउथ कैन नॉट चांट माइंड इज फिनिश्ड व्हाट्स एल आई से ओनली से नमो उक्तिम नमस्कार इवन दैट आल्सो इज नॉट देयर इन साइड वन हुश पर ऑफ इट be conscious highest worship in meditation remember this mantra don't remember your childhood don't remember the girls don't remember the boys don't remember uh, chanting singing dancing or only this one what are you doing what are you doing relative identities because in relation to that you will be somebody in meditation even when there is nothing you are you as you are and for that there is no dharma adharma no right and wrong absolute standpoint not don't relatively don't say relatively left right you have to go on the road don't say dharma adharma virjita so i am on the road where is left side where is right side you'll kill yourself kill everybody no but understand these right and wrong left and right is in relation to something space is directionless lost in the ocean which you know how do you know which is you, which is what direction in the darkness and you can see star and things are there think of it in space you are space how do you know you are in vast space which is left which is right you stand here in relation to you left side for you right side for me front for you back for me back for you it is front so it is left right front back depends on a point of reference when the point of reference goes away this thing disappears some people hold on to the point of reference from my point of reference this is wrong from my point of reference this is wrong this sir what are you talking when the god is for you forgiving the priest will not kanagadasa went to what is this place udupi to see krishna <laughs> the orthodox will not allow him to the go through the center in the main door and look at the god he now no access to that he goes back krishna turns you must have seen it i had not seen first time when i went i went standing in front of the main door looking at it the uh, priest knew i am not local the main door there is no darshan <laughs> closed i was waiting there it will open i'll see no it is permanently closed why because you go back through the window you look at it why krishna turned in south india here your tamil nadu nandi moved nandanar or something nandi moved priest will not god doesn't forgive god is inclusive ishwara everything inclusive can you stand apart from the earth but don't say i am the earth earth is here can you stand apart from the universe cannot but don't say i am the universe universe is here can you stand apart from ishwara conscious universe don't say i am god god is here in that dharma adharma 
Individuality is not. That is why Arjuna says, Yes, Sriyas, please tell me what is the Sriyas. Don't say this is good, that is good. What is that boy's name? Nachiketas. What did he ask Krishna or Yamaraj? Anyatra dharmat, anyatra adharmat, yat pasyasit adbata. Tell me that something which is beyond dharma and adharma. Because I was a bad boy, I knew it's a problem. I became a good boy, suffered. I know poverty will not solve the problem. Prosperity did not solve it either. I know the falsehood will not solve the problem. But truth also puts us into trouble. So take me beyond. Birth or death, both are useless. What shall you enjoy? Birth? Everybody doesn't enjoy birth. Somebody wants to die. He wants to die. When a terminal disease, body is pained, what shall you say? Your people will be sitting around to pray, die, let him go, let him go, let him go, let her go. Why? Death is a relief. So death is good or bad? Immortality, all inclusive, birth and death. Wisdom, all inclusive, good or bad. That is why <laughs> Mahadeva, see that for yourself. The one who introduces us to that dimension, absolute, which is always there. You are freed from the limitations of everything. Things will not go away. You drop out. But what do we do? We hold on to ourselves. Angar is there. Good boy, bad boy. Right? Good thing, bad thing. Continue, connect, continue, continue. Who says not? <laughs> That's not wisdom. Knowing about yourself. Who introduces you to yourself. That is the guru. Tadviddhi pranipatena praniprasnena shevaya. Upadekshanti te jnanam jnanina tattva darsana. Hey Arjuna, go. Question, ask. Pariprasna, question. And then see yourself as you are. So many, close your eyes. So many roles were given to us. We did not come loaded. It's like a new computer. You load it with the different programs. Child unloaded computer. Few things here and there, certain things may be there. But everything is loaded. If you load with wrong programming, the computer will behave funny. Human child. Absolutely flawless. Nameless awareness. Just conscious. That the child smiles. You push thoughts into his head. You give him limited identity, names, conditionings of many kinds. What to see, not to see, what to touch, not to touch, what to do, what necessary, necessary. If you are introducing him to many things, you have got a primary responsibility to introduce him at one time or other to himself. As a child, you cannot introduce a child to himself. But remember, like you are introducing to the puja so that the person do the para puja. You are giving him an int introduce, you are giving him a title, giving him a role, so that you can take him beyond the roles. You educate somebody, you know the education, information will precipitate the ahankar, as the people say that 
sociology hai educating means rescuing the individual from mass of collectivity anonymity when you give education you rescue him from mass of collectivity the one among the billions of people then give him a definite identity phd ma or graduate this you are giving a limited identity since you know the wise man there is a complete history you know since i know when i give this knowledge immediately in the beginning stages it will create a separate identity and that is what the reason for education you give him a separate identity and once you know that separate identity comes that identity considering is self separated lonely isolated will suffer problems therefore help him to when the by product of all education practices information is the ahankara comes up now help him to understand that ahankara himself what is this ahankara so the takes you beyond this ahankara so that the roles are given but the roles don't drown you anymore because you are not there to be drowned so upanishads apara vidya you start with ahankara created with para vidya you manage that ahankar help him understand who he is enjoy the para as well as the apara the tradition is impeccable universal absolute who one who has introduced you to that that person vyasa vyasa purnima ishwara dakshinamurti sada shiva samarambha shankara acharya madhyama asmada acharya paryanta vande guru parampara ram narayanam padmabhuvam shaktim cha tatputra parasaram cha vyasam sukham gaudapadam mahantam yovinda yogindra yathasa shishyam like that is comes down same parampara same wisdom from timeless time in this tradition what a country to be born what a tradition to be born to how blessed we are is good for every humanity every body when you feel grateful about it naturally your heart cries out oh guru oh guru oh shishya oh shishya thinking of an identity which has created trouble for you will you be grateful to somebody my father put me into this trouble my mother did this to me my brother did this to me these people did this to me what are they doing creating problems you go into religion you have the same thing one who takes you away from it when you are absolutely happy with yourself being who you are what a relief free from every rule you are shining in eternal effulgence नित्य सर्वगत स्थाणु अचलोयम सनातन इटर्नली फ्रेश प्लीज चांड होम थ्री टाइम्स
Thank you, friends. So that is what this celebration is all about. You celebrate your life, then it becomes a natural celebration for the Guru, for the God, for the whole tradition. If in your life there is no celebration, that is just a nonsense going on outside, forgetting few things for few minutes. Celebration. You appreciate it. Thank you, friends. Namaste.